Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at the website for Lund University. Today we're going to go over three different studies that are all about the advancement of solar technology, which could bring some great energy to the grassroots around the world. Now, new discoveries about photosynthesis may lead to solar cells of the future. This article, or rather study, has found that energy, the sun's energy, moves through photosynthetic bacteria through the cellular tissue rather than in between the cells as previously thought. They believe that this could be used to create materials that can more easily convert the sun's photonic energy into usable electricity. Now we're going to go over to the University of Houston's website, uh.edu. They've discovered a key mechanism for producing solar cell, the perovskite solar cells, which are a thin film. Very easy to manufacture, but they're still trying to get the recipe quite right. I did another video about adding a little bit of salt to the recipe, literally salt, improve the efficiency of them, as well as they have discovered that if you let it get done just a little bit sooner than previously thought, then it, they become more efficient. They also talk about some of the problems with perovskites. They talk about how they contain lead. I've done another video where researchers in China have discovered different ways to produce those cells. But another problem is that perovskites are unstable in air because they absorb moisture and humidity. Well, another study, we're over at Science Daily now, the Pyong University of Science and Technology, they found a way to make perovskites stable with when it's exposed to the atmosphere so it won't be disrupted by humidity so these three studies combined could help bring new life into the solar field and we are just now on the cusp of a great solar revolution i believe you know you can read more about it in the links in the description and if you'd like to see more news headlines like this subscribe to my channel have a great day